Hospital has refuted claims from video circulating online suggesting that a woman gave birth to twins but was given only one baby after delivery. The management of the Level 4 Hospital has affirmed that a scan conducted before delivery identified features of a single baby contrary to the alleged scenario of twins. Elizabeth Atieno with the details. In this video that has been circulating on social media for three days, women at Mamalu Sikibaki Hospital are seen clamoring for justice, alleging that a mother had given birth to twins but one baby was allegedly stolen at the facility. On Tuesday, the Mamalu Sikibaki Hospital Board of Management broke their silence on the matter, maintaining that only one child was delivered via cesarean section. That video clip that is going around uh, is misplaced, is inaccurate, is untrue, uh, of which we are not certain what the aim and the agenda is. This video is halali, na ujumbe bawa na usema pale si kweli, kweli ni kwamba mama lijifungua mtoto mmoja, na hasa saizi vila tunaongea yupo wadini. With the aid of CCTV cameras in the facility, the family of the new mother have been taken through the events that happened in the hospital during her admission. Thereafter, the father of the baby expressed his satisfaction on the findings, further confirming that they had no scans to prove that the wife was expecting twins. Hapa katikati huwa makonifisho inapone mingi, lakini mimi mwenyeo ni mesimama, ni mefuatiria, ni mepata ukweli ya kwamba mtoto, ni wakike, na ni mmoja. The Mama Lucy Hospital Board of Management led by Doris Kemonto and the gynecologist who conducted the operation say the lady was rushed to Mama Lucy Hospital due to an emergency and a scan was conducted before delivery that established features of a single baby. Both mother and baby were delivered safely uh, via cesarean section. Mother is doing well currently, baby is doing well. We have a baby who is 1.6 kilos, scored 8, 9 and 10, that is APCA score and is currently in NBU. Mama Lucy Kibaki Hospital has been embroiled in controversy in recent times with speculation about cases of medical negligence, a move that prompted the Nairobi County government to institute a new board in April 2023. Just five months ago, a former Mama Lucy Hospital staff was found guilty of child theft by the Milimani Law Courts and sentenced to 25 years in prison. The culprit, Fred Leparan, who worked at Mama Lucy Kibaki Hospital as a social worker, was also ordered to attend 10 years of supervised community service, while his co-accused Selina Award was slapped with a 300,000 Kenya shillings fine or a two-year jail term. Elizabeth Atieno, TV47, Nairobi.